there are a few different kinds of titration curves that you need to worry about. The first one is the most simple. And that's between a strong acid and a strong base. So you can think of these examples as HCl and NaOH. What a titration curve will typically show is on the y-axis, we will have pH. On the x-axis, we will have something like volume of base added. It is usual to add the base to the acid rather than the, the reverse. Let's make a straighter line. Okay. So what we see on a titration curve is your starting pH is gonna be nice and low because at zero volume of base, it's gonna be the pH of whatever the acid is to begin with. Then it'll increase slowly at first, really rapidly, and then level off. I'm gonna draw it a little better. Something like that. At the top, when it rolls over, it's going to roll over somewhere under 14 and approach an asymptote at whatever the pH of the base is. There will be a point of inflection. A point of inflection on the graph is where it goes from increasing slope back to decreasing slope, or vice versa. But in this case, it gets steeper, steeper, steeper. And then when it stops getting steeper, this is where we have an inflection. This is called the equivalence point. Regardless of the titration curve, the inflection point gives us the equivalence point. For a strong, strong titration, that happens at a pH of seven. For a weak, strong titration, it happens at a different pH. The definition of equivalence point is when the moles of the acid are equal to the moles of the base. So if you know some information about the volume and concentration of one, you'll be able to find its moles. And then with its moles, you'll be able, and the volume of the other one, you'll be able to find the concentration of an unknown. So again, equivalence moles acid equal moles base. More specifically, it's the moles of H plus equal the moles of OH minus for a strong, strong titration. The equivalence point, this will always be true, but the curve will be shaped differently for a weak, strong titration.